Hello, I'm Gary Wojcik. I'm New Holland's brand marketing manager for crop preparation products. Today I'd like to talk to you about the significant upgrades to the HP series draper heads. For model year 11, we made more than 30 changes to the HP series draper heads. Those changes start with serial number WS115101 and beyond. One of the first upgrades I want to talk about is the hydraulic system. We've upgraded the hydraulic system to reduce the operating pressure up to 50%, leaving more available power for those tough crop conditions. What we did is we replumbed the system, putting the reel in after the knife drive. That allows the reel to have more speed for certain crop conditions. We also put the drapers on their own circuit, and that eliminates any chance of surging. All of this is going to help you perform better in those tough crop conditions. The next area I'd like to talk about is real durability. One of the things we did for an upgrade for model year 11 is that we installed a spacer in the bat. And here's what it looks like. We've actually taken part of the reel apart here, so the end shield, so we get in here and look at this. But that spacer allows this bolt to be tightened properly and maintain its torque. Another area of real durability has to do with interference that was happening with the corner deflector. We've now made an upgrade to this area that eliminates any interference with the tines and the corner deflector. And the new design also works better in flowing crops like canola. So for model year 11, you're going to have a much more durable reel. Now let's talk about the knife drive and some upgrades we made to increase the knife drive reliability. We've mounted the knife head on top of the knife back raising the whole system about an inch to keep it out of the dirt and also added a strap that is on the drive end to help carry the load and distribute it down the knife back. All this is done to increase the reliability and durability of the knife drive. Okay, I come over to the right side of the head to more clearly show how the knife drive system is raised to keep the knife head out of the dirt. You can see the, the Here's where this, the ground would be, and we've increased this by about an inch with these spacers. And that's going to increase the, the life of the knife drive bearing right in here. Another area of improvement is the guard. I'm talking about the Schumacher guard. We've now designed it so that it can accept a carriage bolt. And that means that you can change the guard using just one wrench. Makes it much more simple and easy to change. The draper decks have been significantly upgraded for model year 11 HP series draper heads. They've been upgraded to increase belt life, reduce power requirement, and to reduce the buildup material inside the draper belt. Let's start with the structural changes to the draper decks. Uh, first of all, we've added this runner. Uh, in the past, prior models, this runner was not here, and, and this is the area where the most load a crop is, and the crop would push the belt down, which causes it to drag harder, the ends to flip up, and also to take more power. So we've added the runner to support the belt and the, and the load of the crop. We've also leveled the runners so they're all at the same height, again to make it run smoother with less power. We've also taken and increased the width of the belt groove to uh, increase it by an inch, basically, and uh, really depending on the roller to do the guiding of the belt. This, again, reduces the amount of the drag and uh, takes less power. We also increase the uh, clearance here for the return path of the draper belt by 5 sixteenths of an inch. Uh, along with that, we increase the, the guide by two inches and also tapered the edge so it doesn't catch the belt and uh, reduced any areas along the way that would catch the belt uh, all in the effort to increase belt life as well as reduce drag. We also made upgrades to reduce the amount of buildup inside the draper belt 
Uh, one of the areas is right here. We filled in right here on both the drive and the idler areas to eliminate crop getting into the belt. Also to help keep material out of the draper belts, we've changed the profile of the hay guard. And you can see the new hay guard here fits tighter to the belt, which keeps material out. You can see the prior design right here, the profile of that. We also changed the mounting. And this also helps in, in crop flow, as far as more efficient crop flow. As a side note, uh, all draper belts will now be installed at the plant and there will be a brace installed to help support the belt in the case that water will accumulate from snow melting and so on. So this needs to be taken out prior to operation of the head. The draper drive rolls have been reduced in size from 3 and 3 eighths to 3 inches. They have also now have a consistent diameter where in the past they were a tapered design. This allows for better belt tracking as well as giving more clearance as the belt makes its path back to return. I've now uh, walked around to the back of the head looking at the, the tensioner to the draper belts. We've optimized this design by using shoulder bolts and taking some of the slack out of the drive. We also use a center pivot sway bar design and also increased the spring, spring rate. We used a heavier spring for the adjuster so you get better belt tracking and more even tensioning of the belt. To add to the improvements to the draper decks, we made a significant improvement by now including the Raptor draper belt, which gives you more durability. It, it sits better in the deck. It tracks better for longer life. You can tell the difference between the Raptor and the prior belt, first of all by the weave pattern. You can see it here, more of a checkerboard pattern versus the stitching before. There's also more rubber added in this area here. You can feel it. If you run your finger down the slat, you'll come to a point where it's a raised surface of a filament cap that's put on here for extra wear life. In summary, I've shown you many of the significant upgrades to the Model Year 11 HB Draper Heads. Upgrades that will truly enhance your durability and performance.